All right, hello everyone. We are live. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Games Mansfield. You may be wondering what's going on right now. Well, I left the quarry a little embarrassed, I have to say. Like, Grace the Brisky really read me to Phil, saying I made all the wrong choices in the end. So I decided it would be so much fun to do a redo. Let's try and like make better decisions. Let's make better life choices this time around. And if we like it, we'll continue. And if not, you know, I'm gonna blame you all for all your poor decision making so we move on to a different game. So, we are going to try and do a redo. Let me just get my YouTube chat going. Is she going, is she going, is she going? Why does it take YouTube so long? There it is, okay. All right, let's begin. We're gonna do a new game and we're gonna make different choices this time. Now that I know what's gonna happen, we're gonna Final Destination this, okay? Like Final Destination, I think it was five. Whichever one that had the tanning beds, where like it had that DVD feature where you could decide to keep them alive if you wanted to, that's what we're gonna do today. So, let's get started. A new game, and hopefully the music is off. Yeah, Twitch going too. Yes, Twitch is going. Hello, 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 everybody. Yes, we are gonna try and make better life choices. I cannot make any guarantees that this is gonna work out. Again, when it comes to life choices, it's not really my thing. So let's see, oh, okay. Stop trying to join, there we are. There's that, hey everybody. Hi, hello, hello. Hey, Bori. Hey, uh, Jackus, Jackus, is that the name, Jackus? Hello. Um, and Math, hello, Math. One second here. Okay. This is pissing me off. Audio. Okay, so it says the alternative music can be in Pack a Lunch, okay? Because she's got quite a roster Why'd you kill the music? films in her bed. I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. Begins or with an L? Two. Like the L word? Yeah. Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're lost. We're just, oh. we're in geographic flux. Right, so... The L word lost. starring Jennifer Grimm. That's debatable. Hey, Louise. Hello. Oh, what's up? <sighs> nice catch there, hon. I'm yeah, not the one who hit the pothole. We're making different choices. I caught it last time. Well, maybe the pothole hit us. Ever think about that? Wow, that is like Olympic-level goalpost moving. Thank you. Very impressive. Thank you. Yeah, we're killing Laura as soon as possible. Yeah, still totally lost. <sighs> oh, James, do you want to try and get all the you cards? Know, Max, Shut okay. up, Bori. You were you the one that made that Twitter you know, post? Was that you? Landed on these golden shores. Were no you the United mess States one? Are you the mess? Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. I bet it was. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Oh, God, are we going to pan that guy and get stabbed again? Are you serious? We're gonna just try and make different choices, okay? Didn't want to be better this time. Lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm it's working already on it. different. I didn't catch the phone this time. I didn't realize the story is like a choose your own adventure. Um, we'll pick up the leaflet. Screw the map. We did the Were map last time. Were there any directions on the flyer? No, just a fake bunch of kids faking it around a fake fire pit. Checks out. What if, you know, they just have Everything a boring okay? evening going yeah, to the camp? Or they go to the hotel? <gasps> Let's see what happens hey, if they go to the eyes hotel. eyes on the road, mister. Oh. Laura, you're dead, okay? I'm not keeping you alive because it really turned out horrible last time. And Max can go too because he's the reason she had no eye. Yeah, yeah. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? So yeah, if you have a messy decision no, no, and it comes to it and it's not something we chose before, we're going to do it, okay? It was a person. Now is the day. We're going to see well, what happens when we do other things. Do you think we hit a person? God, I hope so. I don't know. 
I mean, it was really cl- close. Like, really <laughs> Shut close. Shut up, Timothy. I didn't feel like it because I wanted the car to crash. I didn't feel like it. Let's see. What is it? I really have this car out. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. And we're not gonna snoop this time. We're gonna, like, mind our own business. We're gonna, like, pretend everything's okay. We're gonna be that girlfriend. Because I think they're dating. Which really adds a weird spark when it comes down to her and, um, and Ryan, date, like, flirting later. It's kind of a skanky move. We're not gonna snoop. We're gonna leave it alone. She's gonna overlook everything. Thanks, honey. Hey, Deanne. Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. There you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a I big old fire pit singing campfire sing alongs. Are we trying to save Brenda's song? Yes. Right we are. In front of big old because that was a Why horrible, not? horrible uh, I don't mistake catch I made. Yeah. Apparently, I was supposed to shoot while its back was to me. But we're not going to make the decision again. We're going to go high. We're going to say, screw being a hero, me. let Abby get taken. Because I hated Abby anyway. I'd rather save Brenda's song. Where are you going? Save the gay, too. I did Still last here? time. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. <laughs> Thank you, Louise. I'm glad you're watching it. We'll be compliant. God, Max, hurry up. What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, that is. they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, is he coming with me now? That's different. Oh, fine. They're together now. Okay. Luck with the oh, car. never mind. He's leaving me. He just dropped me in a ditch. Again, is Max cute? I can't decide. What do you guys think? The hang of Hackett's quarry. Okay, we'll get the stupid tarot card. Bory. Okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I had a little issue with the, um, what's it called? With the contour, but we're working it out. I had to rip a wig off because it just wasn't working. Oh, we already saw that, her busted ass poster. Yeah, we get it, your little, you know, five and dime show. Get out of here, no one cares. You and your crystal ball and your useless knowledge. See into the future, my ass. Let's see. I feel like there's tutorials. Let's see. Let's see, menu. No. Display. Tutorials. Oh, there are. Let's watch tutorials. I haven't watched them before. What the hell? Take a moment to consider the following, as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are quick oh, time events, or QTEs, which will help you to act at just the right time. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. I love that. The path you tread is yours to choose, but that doesn't mean there won't be obstacles along the way. 
Wow. I've learned nothing. Okay, let's move on. Basically, hit the button when it tells you to. Got it. Got it. I probably should have had that the first go around, but you know what? It's fine. Everything's okay. Everything's gonna work out great. Let's just walk around the dark, spooky woods and find something fun, you know? Find the makeout point where her and Max can like, you know, go and neck. Is that a phrase people use anymore? Do people still go necking? Let's neck. One of those old 50s words. Let's see. What's going on here? No, I already saw the busted ass poster. I don't want to see it again. The tutorial, don't die. Basically, you know. Sometimes you need to be told that. All right, this is a boring ass nature trail. Let's, let's go back. What's over here? Oh, fine. This is nice. See, under different circumstances, I'm sure it's a very lovely woods. Oh, this reminds me. I remember in Wisconsin, they have a place called Seven Bridges, and all the teens would go there to like make out and like do droughts and stuff. But they always said it was haunted, but I'm pretty sure it's because they were high. I'm fairly certain that's the reason why they thought they were seeing stuff. Get out of here. Anyone cruising on these trails, right? Oh my gosh. So there was a park I used to walk through to like go to work at a pizza restaurant. And apparently back in the 70s, it was like the big gay cruising park. And like there's a big golf course and everything. Like it's very secluded and like tucked around with like lots of like twists and turns. So I can imagine you could like go there and like have some fun if you were like a gay guy in the 70s. Nobody cruises in parks anymore. We have Grinder now. There are dark times, the 70s. Oh, good, a cutscene, thank goodness. <sighs> yes, you're hearing things, Laura, it's fine. Just ignore it, honestly. That's what I would do. If they're not gonna say it to your face, who cares? Tell that hag a hack his core to say it to your face. Bet she won't. <laughs> Cause she's she's a hag. Where are you? <laughs> do you know Ladiana? Yes, I do. I didn't grow up with that though. My parents didn't like instill that in me or the kukui. We didn't have that. They're very Americanized. They used to be the <laughs> Laura, just ignore it. Honestly, I guess she did say it to her face, and Laura bolted. <laughs> We're gonna miss it. Let's see what happens. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be fun. Oh, come on. <laughs> you clumsy bitch. Oh, we're gonna make this bitch trip. Get you clumsy. Hey, 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 okay, whoa. Hey, what's wrong? What's wrong? Talk to me, you alright? Jesus Christ, you're all banged up. No, no, there is something out there. Like, uh, there's noises oh, honey, honey, everywhere. Okay. Just take a few breaths. Just breathe. Just breathe. It's okay. It's the worst. Like there's a, a lot of stuff out there. Just freak yourself it. out. Listen, Max. Especially Matt's... if you're hurt. Can we just get out of here, please? Of course, yeah. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. And Max is like a concerned boyfriend. He's not a smart ass anymore. Look at that. I reprogrammed them. I can change him. Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on. Here we go. Here we kitten go. Kitten that smokes 12 packs a day. Are you fucking kidding me? Max! I just, okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, Max. Laura, you're not helping right now. Can you just, I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just, enough. I'm oh, he I'm apologized. Sorry. I'm surprised she didn't lose a tooth. That's okay. what I was going for. Gonna have to get out and push We're okay. it. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jesus! Oh, oh fuck! 
Oh my Will god, my god. Knock it off, Ted Raimi. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? I want her to play I with matches. You injured. No, yes. uh, well, she bumped her head. Well, barely, barely bumped it. I mean, I, can, I can't even feel it. My bump, not my head. I'm fine. Really, we're fine. Jesus we're just a little Christ. shaken up. It's like, I don't trust you. This looks bad, Max. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of set you up here. I'm sorry. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Drugs. We're doing drugs. Yes. Played through the game three times and haven't gotten all these questions. Yes. Let's be honest. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and... Thank you, Bori. If you remember the other things we didn't we do, are. please let me know. Something jumped out? I want a whole new path. Honest. Uh, I'm sorry, it was, it was so dark and it happened so fast and they were gone. They? Ma'am, did you hit someone? No, no, God, no, of course not. You know, I mean, I don't think so. I don't Only thing I hit was my face on a tree branch. Sir? Keep the car running. Sir? The cop seems anxious. Is this kind of like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. Oh, God. You've never been arrested at least once, Laura? Jeez. Live a life. Are we gonna befriend this sheriff this time? I don't know. Because last time we got like a weird romantic thing happening with him and Laura. Now you folks want to tell I mean, she me. She did end up killing just him. What in the hell like you were doing all the way out here this late at night? Friendly. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out, you know? I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. <sighs> Did he blame her or did he take a blame for that? Gender politics in video games. You're not gonna make it to Haggett's Quarry. Not tonight. You're not gonna make it anywhere. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? I wonder uh, if we can go to the motel. I think we're just I actually kind of want to see it. Sir. I mean, Mr. I'm sure Hatton it's got knows bed we're bugs. coming and we call the head. That's no, a new fun adventure. You're going to head them. to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Compliant. Okay. Fine. Yeah. We'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot I mean, to spring for the middle of no Honestly, coverage plan on my phone. Car. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? Um, yeah! I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay? And then we're going to try and grab his gun. Son, remain in the vehicle. Because I want her out of this, because if she gets infected, it's all effed out. Okay. No, but to choose anarchy, you know about the sheriff's mess. <laughs> yeah, but we already chose that path, Timothy. Okay. I'm trying to make different things happen. I'm trying to kill Laura so early because we... she's just going to become a problem later. So we're going to make her a scaredy cat that gets off right away. All right about something. here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay. And where was Hackett's quarry again? Well... I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Okay, so she's still a little, like, smart ass, even when you try and make her honest. It's just in her nature. Let's 
Still, please. Did they just have a moment? Booper okay. now. It's like, boop. Or do the thing like, oh. you got something on your shirt. Still. Boop. We're not going to recoil. We're going to let it happen. Uncomfortable. Fresh as a daisy. You can like blows his nose with it after. That was weird. It was very weird. I need an adult. I didn't like that. Hey Frey, welcome. <laughs> it's a wild drag queen guess. <laughs> ditto has appeared. Harbinger. You can tell it's a ditto because it has a derpy face, like Stay on the road. <laughs> oh but god, the, what if there's someone out now? there? I did. Yeah, have a look. Damn it. That's what I get for committing to a bit. Good night. Very uncomfortable, I have to say. But let's go to the motel because it sounds nice. I bet it's lovely. They may have bed bugs, but again, that could be an exciting new horror for them. They get to bring that home with them. Why is this guy just sitting there? Because he likes Laura. We're gonna be relieved. I was giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at oh, least she doesn't a dozen like him this whole time. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I Did you see was, that? Was it blood? Honestly, he could have escorted them because they don't know where they're That's going. The... They're just gonna get lost again. Meet you. <laughs> <laughs> Go to the Harbinger Motel so that the sheriff can murder you there because he's like a secret serial killer. <gasps> All right. I should have wrote Let's this get game. back on the road. Yes. I think if you like the movie Identity. Oh my god. That's a good one. I agree. Like, so where's this motel? The motel. Okay, the so we're here. Motel. Mm -hmm. And the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> Very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the oh, motel? Oh, they're still just going? Damn device. it. I wanted to see the motel. We really want to listen to the advice of some creep ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep ass woods to go to some creep ass hotel. No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road. There's a motel. That's what I thought. Ma'am. So oh my creepier. god. If he called me ma'am one more time, I was going to shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm hmm. What? I. 20 you said. Oh. Debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. He's into <laughs> mistress. Okay, well, that totally didn't work out. She's still going to the freaking camp. God. Laura's a chaos demon. Yes! I wanted to see the motel. Well, this is annoying. Well, you know what? I'm going to make sure she gets attacked. And attacked early. We're gonna keep her there. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusion? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Girl, nobody's here. Hello? She is the problem. I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? But if we have the first chance to kill her, we're gonna do I mean, it. Clearly Tanya. there's somebody here. Because she's yeah, super annoying. Why would there be an abandoned? And she gets in the way of Ryan and Dylan's romance, and I don't like that. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Max, honestly, you're too good for her. Is anybody home? <laughs> it's very, am I the drama? Is it Laura? Okay, so we made the most noise last time. Let's try and be extra quiet this time. Okay, we're gonna go down the stairs. We're gonna go to the back to the big scary doors. All right, we're gonna go over here. Oh, she's got her little like flannel draped over her. Like you know, I used to do that in school. It's like you're wearing a skirt. Lovely. How lovely. It's spooky! Hey! Ew. Hey, are you okay? <gasps> oh, 
Oh, I'll so be right it's the, back. Um, I'm gonna get the some owner's help. kids that are down there then. Okay, it's all starting to, it's all coming back to me now. Because those one kids we never Max. actually meet. Max, get over here. Are down there at the moment. There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the law. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get they you out of there. They didn't seem stuck. Because they would have probably come up and said help Wait, if they were stuck. I don't know. You just said tools. Laura, you jumped at the conclusion. Bring... Look, there's someone in there. Uh, Again, that's none of your business. Leave it alone. If someone's look, rocking I'm there, just let right them now. stay there. You don't own the place, Laura. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay. Ooh, gaslighter. Okay, so. Take the hammer, take the wrenches. I think we used the hammer last time, didn't we? Should we do the wrenches? Let's do the wrenches. You sure? sure? Confident. Yeah, I saw it online. Yeah, yeah. saw it online. I learned. I learned on TikTok. It's good. Everything's gonna work out great. Damn. Oh, we're being so quiet. You need a hand? Yeah. Laura is like super into DI. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can make some better choices now because we got Max infected and something tells me he's always gonna end up infected but I'm gonna try and avoid that. You've seen the evil dead, right? Hello? Max, just stay upstairs. Let her get attacked. Are you hurt? Do you exist? Hey, be careful. All right, so you go all the way to the end. We're just gonna ignore it. We're acting like we didn't see it. Bloody collar. They have collars when they transform the werewolves? That's kind of cute. Oh yeah, just leave. That's gross. Max? That's super gross. Juicy. I know, right? My god. Let's just go back. This is stupid. There's no point in staying here. Let's go. I don't like it. I'm gonna go back the way I came. Cause I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. I hate it actually. It sucks down here. Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here. I swear. Hey, oh, Laura, you're so. It's been annoying. kind of a night. You know. Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... No, never mind. Just let tap. Well, damn. Max! You know what? What if we just leave him down there? Max! Guess what? What if we just leave him this time? Yeah. I think I'm bleeding a lot. Yeah, you you are, honey. You're you're gonna die. Leave Max. <laughs> <laughs> you bitch. <laughs> Saw this opportunity standing right in front of me. Yeah. 
Yeah, Laura, that was effed up. Oh, girl, they're gonna fight later. Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel to you? Hey, Polly. Yeah, I know, right? Was she in Twin Peaks? Hey, Siri. There Was Grace and Britsky in Twin you know, Peaks? Secrets and Here's lies. Here's what I found. Paths to Okay, that didn't answer my question at all. On which I can shed light. Was if Grace and Britsky in Twin Peaks? Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. In 2017, she reprised her role as Sarah Palmer on the Showtime revival of Twin Peaks. Really? This is from Wikipedia. She was Sarah Palmer? The one that gets the bag over her head? Oh, Siri's done talking to me. Okay, never mind. Well, fascinating. Okay. <laughs> Duke, you're silly. Chapter one, Hackett's Quarry Forever. She was Laura Palmer's mom. Oh, okay. Okay, work, all right. She's the one that's get, that gets wrapped up in plastic, right? I haven't seen Twin Peaks in forever. Twin Peaks, fire walks with me. David Lynch, good stuff. I like Blue Velvet. Love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. You know what? I bet they're all really great counselors. We reflected. We were cynical last time. Yeah. I mean, you Everyone was so bitchy the last has time. A kind of way of, uh, I need some positivity in my life. Out. I had a rough couple days. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the. Cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me? Okay, spell it. Not I spell wonder if it. I can make them cool. stay inside the house oh, instead so of cool. having we a fire. We are super cool. I wonder if that's a possibility. So she dumped her ass, huh? <laughs> okay, quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey. Hey, bitch. Okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Okay, so we gotta go up into the, the little cabin. Let's look. Let's look around. Wait, I never went down here. Do you think Emma's down there? Maybe we can have like a little moment together. And she could be all like, I dumped you because you're just my summer boyfriend. I'm a, I'm a big skeezy skank. Who's this? All brooding in the corner. Oh, is that Ryan? Weirdo. What are you doing over here? According to reports from the local paper, the North Hill, <clears throat> some hay bales caught fire during the opening. Hey, what are you, uh, what are you listening to? Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke. Good to know. Oh, Ryan, where do you go? He just wants the breakthrough to you, Ryan. Because I feel like you two could be a really cute couple. It's too bad you can't make Jacob gay. That'd be really nice. I feel like he'd be a lot happier. A new gay like him, they'd scoop him up so fast. Jesus Christ. He'd be boyfriended in like a week. And turned like a circuit party hey, game. Are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. Here. It's she Dylan, help it's on. broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's, I, I gotta see get the last bags in there. Come on with this thing. It's just Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. <sighs> cool. Yes, thing. hunk alert. Thanks, pre late. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, I already watched that stupid sign. Never mind. Okay, if I saw it before, we're just going to skip over it because it has no significance. We know where we are. Oh, look at this. The back of Jacob's neck. Enjoy these clothes because they won't be on too much longer. All we have to do is wait for him to go skinny dipping and he'll be in his underwear the rest of the game. Oh, I have to say, he's a lot cuter in clothes, too. I wish you could have alternate outfits. Like, if they all had, like, summer counselor, camp counselor outfits, like, in alternate clothes, that'd be really cute. Like, Friday the 13th. Ugh. Horror. I hate horror. Oh, baby, just wait. I think the bags are over here. Oh, the goddamn tank controls. Get the doors over here, Jacob. You can go through it. There you are. You figured it out, boo. You got this. I believe in you. There they are. <clears throat> like short shorts and a tankini. I'm honestly like short shorts with like the crop top, like super Friday the Thirteenth boy <clears throat> camp kind of vibes. It would be cute with the long socks. I'm telling you, they should be like a DLC. You put them all in camp counselor outfits. All right, got the bags. Great, all by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh. Okay, She's here not we go. Mean. She's okay, London you're not Tipton. telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Let's see. He was defensive last time. Let's be playful. Oh, okay. So now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. Oh, oh sorry. I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are really? we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Wait, he's a sailing instructor? I didn't know that. Smug. <laughs> Knew it. <laughs> Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. <laughs> I started playing this with my friend and we were dying so each every really time they did slow-mo zooms huh? in the faces. Okay. <laughs> Her whole thing. Is like how are we we're gonna, gonna make try this and be better. Different schools, but if there's blah, certain blah, characters blah. annoying, we're My just gonna let them die. Is like, I decided you know, this is where we are. Maybe long distance, blah 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah. Do not pass go. Man, she just got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she I do it? I would say it's dainty. <laughs> defeated or brave? I feel like we were defeated last time. Let's make him brave. No, oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a stupid summer fling. What else did I think was going to happen? Uh, let's see. Sure, wow. Uh, love, stability, engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation, empty nest, retirement, grandkid, 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 a uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. That kind of in the ballpark? That was a long Oh, shit, line. I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Oh, actually, that's just a generic all-men list. Well, that seems legit. <laughs> it's not horrible. Okay, so are Although sure cumbersome, that this Roadhead is very difficult to do. <laughs> We'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, it doesn't oh, it kill will. you. We'll make you if stronger. If it's anything like the oh, last I game. I killed you. Very brutally. Yet. She got like the You're worst death pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> Not as fun as they say, honestly. Uh, okay, honestly, so, um, it's difficult. Total hypothetical, Very hard. but if Came I was neck, like a honestly. huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all 
rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Oh, bitch, she knows cars. Jake, F friggin' Marissa Tomei over here. Even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust it me, really would. chicks made up her mind. She's yeah. dead meat. Okay, the first second sure. I chance, first chance I get to kill her, it's happening. Guess we'll just have to find out. <sighs> oh, let's see. Did we break the rotor arm or did we break the fuel line last time? I can't remember. What should we do? What's got the least bits of, you know, bad side effects? Boy, do you remember? Was it the rotor arm or the fuel? Steel. Steel. I don't know. Everyone's saying steel? Okay, let's do it. Because I can't remember. Okay, good. Thank you. Y'all are so honest. Me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D -d 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 oh, Nick! I'm gonna catch it. Boom. Oh, oh. there it is. Oh, Ooh. man, good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Oh, Ooh, I wish I that had was some worth sales. catching. Freaks, <clears throat> I'm surrounded by freaks. <clears throat> oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have like charged up our phones like a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> you know, you should How really just save off? it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped <laughs> an emergency. Oh, Ben. Ryan, the negging, it's not gonna get you in his pants any faster. We'll be friendly. Uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hook. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? Damn. Where's everybody else? I love how why, authoritative why Brenda's song is when I do mm -hmm. this show. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to Wait respond to Lynch. that. Wait I blew her face off so last time. Maybe she'll shoot off Laura's face. Study gets any cheeky <gasps> okay, yeah. That's what Keep we're doing. Me. We're gonna blow off Laura's face. That's the plan. It's gonna be Lynn Shay's revenge. Because honestly, she was over way too soon. And I didn't get to see, you know, the range. The colorful, layered performance that Lynn Shay probably brought us in this game. Okay, Abby, we're killing you. It's decided. I don't like you anymore. So Abby, Emma, and Laura are for sure dead meat. So she's going to trip. She's going to stumble. She's going to angst her way to an early grave. It's happening. It's decided. Her and her stupid little notebook. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five, up top. Miss. Oh, too slow. Really? Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. What? It's obviously she what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. Then by shape our destiny, I mean... Shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Right. Just leave the bags. Are you serious? That's called breaking and entering. No, that's called retrieving our lawfully owned possessions. Why don't we just find Mr. Hackett and have him open it back up? Abby, come on. Our stuff is like three feet away. Mm, sorry. No. As soon as we get back to the lodge, we'll find Mr. Hackett and have him help us get our bags. Fine. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, well, She sucks even more. Well, fine. I'm just gonna do a quick sweep then to make sure we didn't forget anything. Knock yourself out. Emma thinks you're overreacting. Well, Emma's gonna be dead soon, so... 
she can kiss my ass. All right, let's see. The tree, that's where I have to go. Go to the tree and find the poppers. I never thought I'd say that line out loud, but here we are. Go to the tree, recover the poppers. Do the poppers and drive the go-kart. That's the plan. Ooh, that would be fun. Doing poppers and then driving a go-kart? Girl. I remember Crystal Lake, not that one, but when I was a little kid, it was like a, like a camp Ouch. my parents would take me to. So like Jacob one of those campgrounds with trailers and stuff. And it always had like the townies that were very like bumpkin-y. And you drove around on go-karts to get around everywhere. Ugh. Fascinating Ew. stuff. What is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. I'm pretty sure those townies were on something because they're very wild. You did, did she do the poppers? Oh, wow. Good for her. Live a little, Abby. Loosen you up. Okay, and I think we just gotta go over here, the go-kart. I don't really feel like exploring. When are you gonna get your own engine model with the exchangeable hairs, do you think so much? When are you gonna get your own little Unreal Engine model with... Oh, I don't know. Honestly, what's an Unreal Engine? What does that mean? Are you speaking like video game talk to me? All right, where the hell is Emma? I'm gonna get the hell out of here. This place is dumb. This place sucks, I'm leaving. Emma, where are you, goddamn bitch? Okay, okay that, let me go over here. There she is. Let's get out of this place. This place is a dump. Oh, making your own game. That would be fun, honestly. Or like one of those games I can create myself in. Like, I tried that Street Fighter game, and it was not the choice. Was, there was no high heels, so I couldn't get into it. And the hair options were not it. Let's go. Let's play Ready sex. to roll? Enthusiastic. Good. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. All right, Indigo Girls, get the hell out of here. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, Hell yeah. in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. It's the poppers. <laughs> you should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. We're going to try and keep Nick alive. Ooh, what happens? Oops! Eyes on the road, lady. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oops! I'm so bad at driving. Okay, so, okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what it's if not it's gonna like matter because you're dead meat. I'm like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But... Did you explain that? That's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Honestly, you would have broken up over Facebook months from now. It was in the back of the game for the day. So, you made the right call Email. There. Are you 93? What's wrong with email? The second he gets to that college, he's going to forget all about you. I'm really going to miss you, Abby. Oh, hold up. Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. It does kind of like the what? first first way. Come on, scenic route. One last victory lap around the camp. No. The sooner I get to the action, the better. Back to the lodge. Piss off. We should really get back. Boo. Thumbs down. I've, everyone's waiting for us. Emma thinks Nick you're being a party pooper. Emma goodbye. can fuck off. Cause I'm over. Shit, her. Abby. Run it over. <laughs> oh no! Did I hit it? Did I hit it? It's dead, honey. First body count, the squirrel. Oh, well, Max, it's so still Max alive. on the squirrel. That do the kill count. Good. What do I do? You're a murderer, Abby. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Put it out of its misery. 
And I can't. Abby, it's suffering. It's fine. It wasn't me, okay? It was Abby. You guys saw that. Kill it or return the cart. What should we do? We never got this before. Oh my gosh. The blood is on our hands now. Do we kill the imaginary squirrel? <laughs> Roadkill for dinner? Oh my god. <laughs> and she's holding it. What do we do? This is a new choice. I didn't expect they had to kill this early. Eat it. Should we return the cart or should we kill it, you guys? Help me decide. <laughs> Either way, it's gonna die. And honestly, you saw the way that squirrel came out. It wanted to die, all right? It just came charging at us. Who knows what it was capable of? Okay, decision is stuff it in your hair and add volume. God damn it, absorb. I'm just gonna decide myself. We're gonna kill it. I did it. I made this choice. The blood is on your hands, Abby. Oof. Brutal. And that makes two for the kill count. The squirrel was on a death mission. I'm telling you, it wanted to die. It was coming right for us. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas. That was a test. Shut up, absorbent. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. <laughs> It's okay, I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. Uh, oh. ew. Don't let Ryan hear you. <laughs> I just killed a squirrel. Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? She's oddly jovial and cheerful Please. for someone that just killed something. Let's go. Maybe that's what she was missing in her life. Where the are thrill your of murder. Mr. H locked them in the cabin already. That's why her hair is all red. Why? To keep out berries? Apparently. You thought that was a henna rinse? No, baby. That's the blood of squirrels. Okay, questioning or sarcastic? Let's see. Were we sarcastic last time? Bears can be a problem. Let's do it. Yeah, bears can be bad news, especially if you've been, you know, trying out their variably heated oatmeals. I really don't think there are any bears. I tried to get the bags, but someone was all, wouldn't that make us criminals who deserve to be in jail? You're paraphrasing, but yes, it would. <laughs> mm, I don't think Mr. H would have been too happy to see his cabins vandalized. Oh, Thank God. you. <laughs> Did I just make the relationship happen faster? Hey, Gross. has anyone seen Ryan? That's on me. Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious. Her killing and stuff really somewhere. made her awfully I'm cheerful. Here. I'm still out over that. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, Always choose the positive response. We'll try it. Oh. Because they were awfully nice. bitchy cool. last time. What's it about? Protective or friendly? Let's do friendly. Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast? about you okay if anyone here had a podcast about them it'd be me yeah if there was a podcast called how to look and smell like a butt oh my god you are so childish really so don't look and smell like a butt <laughs> no it's a, it's a paranormal podcast this episode was Boring. actually about this place really enough the hag of hackett's quarry the who of the what's it gotta go now? for a boring ass adventure and choose the good what's options. the hag of hackett's oh. quarry Straight you know flirting is right, Trusty, quarry. honestly. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, I don't Their think name she is wants Brenda to know Song. about the Hag of Hackett's uh, Quarry. Uh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Yeah, call her the it's woman of a certain age of Hackett's for Quarry. The kids. It's, um, they're supposedly an old it woman. It really rolls off the tongue. died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods. In my story, she got stabbed through the heart boy. with a spear. They're like 
reports of whispers. So you're already getting the lore wrong, or whatever, Brian. And this figure that floats around, you know, textbook kind of Mr. stuff. Mr. Know-it-all. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you. Oh. Or something. Like all these itches on my really son. Anyways, Is Tiger she make you? you made that up. She's got Mickey, her son. Oh, you're in the podcast. Right? <gasps> cool story, bro. I love that. Supportive. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time he told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for <laughs> life. You gotta be careful with oh, this Jesus. stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude. Bullshit. Dylan, you're the only one What's the hold up, hack of tears? You deserve hey, yeah, the world. Yeah, nearly done, Mr. H. Hop to it. Get those butts in gear. Coulda, woulda. How do we kill David Arquette? Are we able to? Because I kind of want to. Sounded like he said, of course, Let's Mr. Go screen H. Five We're on it, Mr. Mr. H. Sorry, Mr. Hackett, but our, our bags. Right. Cabin. <laughs> We're really busting our butts here. Well, except Ryan, who's trying to scare the pants off our butts with his weird ghost stories. Okay, okay, enough with all the butts. Uh, David Arquette does not approve of What's this about stuff. ghost stories? Each of HSQ. Noted. The hag of Hackett's quarry. I was just strictly for her. Uh, for Pete's sake, Ryan. <laughs> the hag of Palm Springs, Bianca or Trixie. Hey, you still have the Bianca. Mr. She was there longer. Well, yes, I A bit do. Longer in the tooth, I might say. You know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Can he lose his head? Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, I wonder. Okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Understanding. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. Ah. Uh, okay, that had a positive outlook. They're gonna listen to each other's playlists. I bet Ryan's playlist sucks, though. What would be on his playlist? What do you guys think? So, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, They're probably like shit uh -oh. from like 2010 not that's like fired, not even relevant I? anymore. Like MGMT <laughs> no, or uh, something. It's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Joy Division, probably. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Listen to the podcast. Being on the straight and narrow is so boring. My gosh. But I guess David Arquette's going to like him more, and that's truly what Ryan wants, is David Arquette to like her. Sorry about that, bud. Sorry about These that, bud. These kids their phones. Didn't mean to push you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand? Looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school He's thing. He's asking about your version of Bud stuff. What's that right. all about? You, you Is know, that a hang up from Courtney Cox or something? Whether or not I should, like, leave my I'm sister curious. with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus, you know, my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to David Arquette is such a red flag in every horror the film, honestly. small enough as it is. Well, Although I think he's only ever been in like one. Right. Has he been in other ones? Was he in Phantoms? Dang hey it. Siri, was David Arquette in Phantoms? I found this on the web. Is everything okay? You got a hot date tonight? Was David Arquette oh in Phantoms? If you only knew. Here's what I found. <laughs> Let's see, IMDb. We'll find out ourselves. Series useless. Ryan, I told you to make sure everyone was ready. What happened? They don't really listen. Internet to movie database. Then you gotta make them listen, David bud. Arquette. I can't. Uh, I mean... Credits. Shoot, no time to get their bags now. If 
For real? I don't think the girls are gonna like that. We'll ship them along in a few days. Let's see. So, uh, chefs, what, what did you need me for? Talked, because, You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. Search. One of the good ones. But, do you know how many calls Tipper, I get from parents? Dirt letter squirrel. after that letter. With these terrified kids that they send home. Huh. I, I guess he I wasn't in fans. Who was Believe that it or not, guy? Scaring kids away from was sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe, it was. maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. You're not the boss of me. Apologetic. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Got to understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. Ugh. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Right. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? Right. What's that? You guys don't do kumbaya anymore? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Right. Buster, I know. It's in your cup. Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. It's in the cup. Understanding. Totally. Yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Yep, uh huh. Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters hop to, to it the second right. camp's over. It's not safe. Hmm. Where in the good goddamn are they? They're in the cup! Oh my god. Ugly. Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrap yard during the off season, and Kaylee, really? well, she's still figuring out what she oh, wants to do. Oh, that's why that war wolf was there. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? That makes sense. Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. We don't want to highlight but her, but her most you iconic sad, you scene. Has got to be Rose McGowan's garage Jeff Dorsey. Oh, I'm yeah. The Honestly, van, yeah. She was in Phantoms. Pocket, I do know that. Came in the office. We don't like Rose McGowan anymore. What'd she do? Did she do something? I must have missed it. Fill me in. Right where I left her. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. Last I checked, she's just like doing the charm, like convention circuit. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Yeah, I don't know enough about it. And again, I kind of dropped off with her when it came to, like, Charmed. I mentioned this before. Wait, like, um, when you get your charm back I kind of stopped watching. I she's, like, she's, she's fine, you know? She's you should good. have turned it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Run. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Cause it's time to dwell in the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Oh Move no, it, the go. car's not working. It's almost like somebody took the, hey, what about the rotary bags? something. Uh, the rotary Emma, I'm gonna have to ship them to you tomorrow. Hell no, thing. no, I am not leaving without- It's the way it's gotta be. Come on, Jacob, start her up. What was in that bag that she had to have? What's the problem? Ugh. Dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. Remember All when right, Jacob got his throat ripped out? What, that dude, was unfortunate. You, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Oh, God, that still happens. Shit. Come on. All right, come dude, on. chill. That's not cool. Chill, dude. Oh, God. Jesus. Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn A it! A little intense. A little much. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. He's doing okay. the 
almost. Damn it. You're right, you're right, yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. He seems so shocked. Oh shit. There we go. You guys gotta remind me when that happens, because I'm gonna forget. Hey, Brian. So we're gonna Come try and keep it second. gays alive. We're trying to keep it gay. And we're gonna try and kill Laura as soon as possible so that she doesn't interfere with Brian and Dylan. Make sure that we're on a mission is here, inside okay? the lodge for tonight. It's gonna Lock get the freaking doors. gay. No one in, it no one kills out. Me. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have right. to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? I don't know if I can, but we're gonna try. Compliant. Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. Right. What happens if, like, they go inside and just have a nice, quiet evening inside? That'd be a so, different change of pace. Like a nice little relaxing what was that about? Like you, uh, said to stay inside. That we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We Again, he had enough room in that car. He could just yeah. drop him off at a station or, or something. Or the hotel. Or we could do something else. Like, they don't have money to put the kids up in hotel rooms for the night? Insistent. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Yeah, no strip search, sorry. Of course. Uh, Those strip events. Who cares don't worry. what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P A R T. Why the fuck not? All right. It seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes, I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man, Caitlin. I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? Cause he's bored. Let's see, were we apprehensive or supportive last time? I can't remember. Help me out. How are we doing? What are we gonna do? Choose the boring one. Let's see. Don't support them. We were supportive last time. Okay, we're gonna be apprehensive. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, Dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. No, 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 dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you uh The group is getting bored of Ryan. Daddy. Defensive or dismissive? Let's see. Are we defensive or dismissive? What did we do last time? We're just trying to see the dialogue. Hmm, defensive. Okay. Yeah, well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris told Boo! me. Oh. Ryan, come on, man. Wait.
All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers. LOL. This Party game planning committee. Let's do this. Um, minutes, okay. First things first. Really? Are they all gonna die? You want to get some firewood? Uh, M and I. I'm fine with that too. For you some know? supplies. It was a lot of work and, last uh, time. Dylan, I had to go through caves and shit. I don't know. Figure it out how to too much. charge the phones for something. All right, let's do this. <gasps> that means they're not gonna kiss anymore. Okay, the sniper. Yeah. Can I remember this? That's the goal, Luis. I'm gonna try new things to like see like what happens. The boring ones get them all safe at home, with, but uneventful. I don't believe you. I don't believe you for a second. And again, it's not going to be completely uneventful because we are killing Emma. So that's happening. I've decided there's a target on her back and, and Abby. Abby's dead meat. Why is he always so bloody? Is it like a walking dead thing? Why are they so dirty? I saw in that one plane crash movie. Oh God. Hmm. What was that movie? First course. Alive. Today, it's alive, right? With the plane crash and the soccer Rich team. Full body, that was brutal. This rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Ow. Wow. What? It was alive, yeah. Yeah. Looks a like brutal reference, a Emma. Jeez. They just remade oh that God. recently. It was I'm good. Done, okay? It was good. Jesus I forget what it's called, but it's on Netflix. Record, your analogies are very hurtful. <sighs> okay, I'm almost there. One second. Pick the lock. There we go. It's like Jill Valentine. Yeah. Viola. <laughs> Your hair clip. Jacob, better. I knew you, the master of all mocking. Yeah. Let's see. Playful or sarcastic kids. This is brand new, so let's see where this decision takes us. You're good with your hands. Took you long enough. Thank you, Peachy. Yeah, I thought it was. What shall we do? Which Quarry character did you like when you first played? I like Jacob, so I'm trying to keep him alive because I was unsuccessful in the last attempt. Um, let's do Playful. I like a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> no. Oh. no. Well, damn. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Oh, honey, there's no beer there. Beep, Those hillbillies beep, drank all of it. Beep, You're going to have to make your own. Beep, beep, what beep, are you doing? Beep. Why does she stand like oh. that? <laughs> uh, the way she stands is so dar? strange. Helps it's me like, dar for beers. Huh. Out. How am I just noticing how super like, What are you, you doing? doing? What? But it, it's my beard art, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over it's here. very strange. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. They drank all the beer? Mr. H loved his accessories. Get the Stanley Cup. Next choice is pick the left one. <laughs> okay. I think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> I 
Oh. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh. Watermelons. Hey, my uh, coconuts. Check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it? Mm-hmm. You Didn't she's wearing vodka. a push-up bra? It's party time. You just I think she is. Vodka right because they're sitting really yeah. high. It's the most fun it's you like could have Patty with the whole from Elvira, the movie, or, where she had the padded bra oh. on. Second most. And it's like, they're up here, and like she okay. adjusts her I'm boobs, and like her boobs would move to her neck. Go look for some more party supplies. That would explain why she's always wearing a sweater. Like Patty was. Okay, so you just gotta go through here and then get the hell out of here. Go around here, go around there, carry the one, screw that because it's boring. Let's just look at the carnival that tells us nothing. Question, old movie buffs. Anyone ever see Trog with Joan Call with Joan Crawford? Where um her her co-star is a caveman, like a guy in a really bad gorilla suit. It's like a gorilla mask, and he just has like a buff body. <clears throat> a brazier. I tell you, she's wearing a padded bra. That explains why she's always like standing the way she's standing. Eh? Kind of boring. All right, it's boring, boring, boring. Let's keep moving. Nothing over here. Anything over here? All right, let's get here. Oh shit! Was I already this way? It feels like I was. Let's keep going. This store all looks the same. Did I really just turn myself around? Did I turn the beat around? I think I did. I just need to find the little back door and then we can have our little scene. What is this? Lodge renovation plans. Are they gonna tear down the quarry? All right, walk around the table. And we just gotta go to the scary back room. And then we should be done and be out of the general store. And they find like those little expired cheesy poofs and they're really excited about it. Okay, I can't see a goddamn thing. So hopefully we wrap this up soon. Emma, find your way around the goddamn store. I really wish they'd give you a map or something. Find the basement and get Sia out. Oh, shut up. Oh, my God. Okay. Um. Let's see. He's got to do that stupid song. Yes. The peanut butter butter pops or something, which I wonder how they taste. Do you think it's like a sweet popcorn or something? I bet they're like long expired. No brewski beers in here. Yeah, we got to go find the gun. I think that's the door over here. Am I wrong? I wonder where this goes. Oh, thank God. Okay, we found it. Locked. <sighs> Call Jacob. Jacob! Come check this out. Oh, uh, <laughs> all righty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Oh, I thought I was going to do something more intense. Oh, nice. the lock. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I have a lockpick. Better take it with you. Fucking mother of 
Good golly, Miss Molly. I Just if talk like Mary like Burton the entire stream. That could be fun. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. What? No. I mean, I've we have to here. It's like, um... <clears throat> human rights, or... Whatever. Sure. Yeah. You know, feminism or something. Now, let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Lock him in. They stay safe oh. the whole night. Hell yeah. I mean, he may die in there, but at least he's safe. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. All right, let's go find the gun. We're chaotic. And we're not long for this world anyway. Oh, cool. What? What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. And a code. Maybe it's to that safe. Emma, uh, don't point the gun at people. I'm done. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's get out of this place. It sucks. Okay. Oh. So you're, uh, you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. For bears. Okay. Uh, well, I only am bear gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. Please tell me they're gonna guide me to the. Oh, I have to walk through the. Oh, god damn it! This place is so confusing. You guys would do this to me. God damn it. Okay, let's go around here, and I think there's a shortcut to the front here. No, that's just the cage. Okay. God damn it. Get out of the lottery cage. We go there. Let's go around here. This spooky stuff. Ooky spooky. Let's get out of here. This place sucks. Ignore that. It's just a poster. Okay, far here. I go through here. Oh, never mind. I guess not. Shit. Okay. Go around here. Yes. Okay. I hook a corner. Go through here. Why is this place so confusing? It's like a freaking labyrinth. All right, here we go. We're good. Let's get out of here. Uh, hey, Jacob. Right. Open the open the safe. Do it. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> oh, good. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. Jake, you're such a child. Leave the fireworks. I feel like fireworks are crossing a line. What? But you got a gun. Why can't I have firecrackers? Because the gun is for bear protection, and the fireworks could start a forest fire. Good. Stupid That's very fireworks. actually responsible. <laughs> and you look like you're in California, which is very much a problem. Oh, oh, stop. 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 Stay right there. Uh, oh, dude! Oh, the fucking peanut butter, butter pops. Butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. Affectionate. Let's not be what a bitch. What are butter pops? <laughs> no. What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop. Pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack. It's catchy. Of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre of food snack. Well, now I want to try it. I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um. So. No, they're still good. Oh what God, happens like is, they okay. stay inside because Look, they all they got food poisoning from those expired well, peanut butter pops. Well, you're gonna love them. Yeah. Oh so what do you think they are? Do you think it's like, um, those like, well, Cheeto puffs, but like, I saw peanut butter a wheelbarrow flavor? out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm Maybe sorry, it's what? like one of those, booty? like, snack foods from oh, another country like, that um, they really like hype treasure up, like shapes or buds. from Australia. <laughs> No, those really got hyped that. up for me. And tin tams. Wheelbarrow? They really overhyped uh, yeah. those. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> oh, 
Ladies first. Yeah. Which way? Hey, my eyelash. Oh, my eyelash. Oh, my God. The song was kind of giving, not gonna lie. Peanut butter, butter pops. Butter, butter pops. It kind of sounds like peanut butter jelly time. Maybe that's what they were like biting when they wrote that. All right. The possibility the inner sanctum. Is. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. I'm thinking caramel popcorn, but hardened <laughs> yeah, peanut butter. Quick... Or oh, sure. oh my gosh, give me a sec to get like those um, candy popcorns. They have it like Aldi, where and it's like Snickers or um, M and M's, like dumped on top of popcorn and sold Podcast. as snacks. And they're like hard as rocks. Yeah. Like it's All the right. hardest food in the world to eat. Because popcorn covered in anything, it's already like a recipe for disaster. Because those things always get stuck inside my mouth. Dismissive or friend? Let's be friendly. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, bizarre yet bona fide. So like ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, bona fide. Right. Boner, fide. Get it, boner. <laughs> Boner, yes, Your wit knows no bounds. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. What happens I mean, if we don't What snake? kind of dirty is secrets is the option? owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. I mean, David Arquette, I can see having ulterior motives. All right, let's see, let's move around here. Yo, my guy, toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I, I'm sorry, is that something statement. that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. Oh! Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's, you're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine, don't let me regret it. This. Dialogue is so loaded right now. Gays can't catch. I beefed it. <laughs> I don't play sports. He does. Huh. Everybody want attention? Attention? Fashion icon. Out. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. The softer side of Sears. Wow. Yo. The hidden hey, room hey, is maybe really we nice. It's like 14 uh, cameras. Ryan? Like David Arquette's just sitting in front Whoa, of that computer screen, fun? like that guy, like... These monitors, this is the cam. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids. <clears throat> what they if it's one of those weird situations, no, like 14 cameras, like a, ch like a Chuck Berry cameras. kind of situation? What are trail cameras? Got the, like, set the them up cameras in the toilets and stuff? Catch weird, random shit. Very, okay, very yeah, like what? Like uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. Um, let's, let's get out of here. Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Secret Expensive hobby. hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you going like to do out here? Like weird spy equipment hidden yeah, inside of a secret room. That's totally no normal. Yeah. Yeah, David Arquette's giving me a weird feeling. I'm okay, like, but why go I don't all the like trouble it. of hiding this room I'm calling through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. 
Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it's weird. It's major league yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but it, it's it's got to be something juicy. You, 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 you're doing it. You can't dig about business. this whole Ryan. I mean, if you really want to know, it's you can pretty ask weird. Him tomorrow, I'm sure, that won't be an awkward conversation, like at all. Maybe he owned a radio yeah, shack. <laughs> maybe John. All right. <laughs> give give that line to Ryan. I, he should have said that. The secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Mmm. Eh, it's boring. Let's go. The camp. The woods. In the dark. Okay. Where's the exit? I'm bored. Oh, good. 28%. You could work with that. You could totally work with that. Just put it on low battery mode. That's at least a good hour. Sounds like shit. All right, let's keep it moving. Oh, it's a bedroom? I, I never went into this room before. Let's go to bed. All right, let's see. It's got boring taste. All right, let's move around. What's in here? Whoa, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. <gasps> Take the pills! Yeah, there's nothing fun. I gotta take dolls and get some sleep so I can get up in the morning and sparkle, Neely, sparkle. Let's see. God damn it, Dylan, just go this way, stupid tank controls. All right. Now let's see, go to the phone so we can end this shit early. Nice. Full up. I had the party. Hey, done so. All right, cool, let's go. Thank you. Go to the party. Wait, Ryan's going to the party now? I thought he didn't want to go. You're already not sticking to your own store. Oh, fuck the woods. I hated this part. I always got lost. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> they always seem to listen to you during painting class. She taught painting? You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this that shortcut that I take that goes by. Which way should we go? Uh, Why don't you choose? Let's see. Which route did we go? We took Shady Glade last time, right? Should we go to the Rocky Road? I feel like either way, it's gonna suck. Which route should we take, kids? Are we feeling the Shady Glade or the Rocky Road? I feel like we didn't take the Rocky Road last time. You guys got better memory than I do. Ugh. My memory just hasn't been what it was. Ugh. Oh, I gotta take that out. That's killing my ear right now. Oh, they're pretty, but they hurt. I'll put them back in later, but oh. Okay, Abby, you're not helping. Where are we going? This looks nice. This looks pretty. We're gonna go this route. I can actually see where I'm going, so this is nice. There we are. Thank Shit. You. It's all right. Calm down. This way. Let's keep it moving. I didn't realize how homophobic this game was, honestly. All right, let's keep it going. This is pretty. It's like a little nature walk. I mean, I personally would never go on it, but it's, I feel like it's the same thing. Like if you choose either route, because it looks exactly the same. 
I didn't program any new route. It's all the same shit. I feel lied to. So they gotta go and they gotta see the pig. I'm just gonna let the pig attack them. So you ever think about what's next? Like, like death and stuff? After we die? Has a little path on it, so we're just gonna follow you and see where it takes us. Take me to the next cutscene, damn it! Are we going downstairs? Uh, there's stairs. Okay, sweet. Let's keep it moving. Come on, Aussie boy, keep it shuffling. I'm trying to get out of here. I'm gonna get the action. Let's get to the bonfire. Oh, this is. Yes, okay, now we are. So, yeah, this is the exact same place. So, the Shady Grove and Rocky Road are exactly the same. Good to know. I was lied to and given the illusion of choice. They didn't feel like programming that into the game, apparently. Oh, I know where we are. You know, this shit's been out for like yeah. six years now. Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. This view is just... What are you sketching? Wouldn't it be a gag? Like he thinks she's sketching a sunset and like he looks at her folder and it's just like that famous symbol that everyone sketched in middle school. I would love, I would live. <laughs> See, sincere, playful. Do me. Ooh. Do me. Sorry, I'm, I'm just trying to get this down. Right. Sorry. Dumb idea. I just want to finish this. Take your time. Oh, God. Abby, you are dead meat. I'm telling you, the second you start running for your life, you're tripping, baby. God, she's boring. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's a pig. It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. <laughs> oh, look! It's so tiny. <laughs> My god, he's so... Petting that dirty ass pig. Hold on. He's probably crawling with rabies. Nah, we're not gonna save her. Let her get tackled. I wonder what happens. Okay, did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French. Oh. And that's the end of your romance. Because we're gonna try and keep Australia alive or New Zealand. What's his name? I always don't remember his name. Brenda Song! I finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Wow. 
Let's see. What are we gonna take a picture of? I'm gonna angle it up and then there, and then get the sun glare in it. Big old lens flare. Yeah, that's the one. That's the keeper. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. I H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not. Whoa, no. Back up. What? His eyes Holy are goodness. everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You right. don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. He'll probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? To be fair, I didn't ready? investigate further. Still no service. But I always uh, assume the worst. Yeah. That's how you stay alive. So, pretty boring. Right. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag uh, hacking. Okay. Okay. Woman of a certain age of Hackett's quarry. You no, know, I just right? realized we may never see each other Hackett's again after tonight. It's very you ageist, can't have just Brian. realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood. Quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. You don't know oh. nothing, okay? I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Now she got weird. She's quirky. Whoa. She's so random. Special delivery. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not her even cabin. a cabin. She's uh, always packing around. I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, oh, hey, 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 cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. Has what, you gonna shoot me over there? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Oh, crap, Absolutely I gotta shoot not. again? No. Not leaving you with a gun. Okay, there is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me. Ugh. It's never shootout. fun, because every First time I ties, shoot, something dies. Butter, butter pops. That's every how yourself. Jacob died last time. Dude, I guess you don't no, really want No, it was want Brenda. Brenda Song died. Pretty sure. I can't remember. Ryan died, too. Fine, you're on. Yeah, every time I have to boy. shoot something, it never goes well. Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. I mean, if you ever played Red Dead, that's All exactly right. how you die. I guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back way? there. That's but a good question. If I see either of you dicking around, I am turning What ages around. are they? Oh, uh, like, again. Brenda's song has to be like 30 here. And they're all talking about college. So they gotta be like around like 18, 19. So, just so you know, I was an expert marksman. <clears throat> Third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick. But if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know <laughs> okay, if you actually- Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? It's London okay, Tipton, 30-something. with Abby in the woods. Let's see, how old is Brenda Song? Brenda Song age. 35. Yeah, she's like, like a few years older than me. Evasive or hopeful. It was okay. It was... It was okay. Hey, 
a boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah. She is a mm, wet log. Yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look, no sweat, okay? Yeah, I, she's married to Macaulay Culkin. I found that out make randomly when I saw his Walhalla Walk of Fame ceremony. It was oddly touching. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest uh, at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep right. your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Right. Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. Right. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obvs. Right. Let's make him a really terrible shot. Let's have him like shoot at everything. And all right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay, good. And then we aim the gun at Brenda Saw. All right, Nick. This time for real. Oh, shit. Damn it. Okay. Let's make him really bad. Like, laughably bad. Like. Oh! Nice shot. I didn't even aim at it. All right, let's do our. It's just gonna keep letting me shoot until I hit something. Let's do it right below. Yeah, Lucky. this is fixed. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right, let's. We made Jacob right. a laughing stock last wanna, time. Uh, let's make him, you know, eyes, Nick. a daddy dom. I don't now. want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude. blaster. Jesus that Christ, is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Let him go. We'll be friendly. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't want to <laughs> say it, but you're both very mean. Blam. We thought this was over. What the? Whoa. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. All right, kids. I think I might call this one because we haven't got to this bonfire yet. And I need to sleep because I have to do brunch tomorrow. So I'm going to call this and next week we'll pick up and we'll try and make better choices. I have to sleep.